Rodgers. And now he's got him up. Black Jaguar power bomb. The Black Jaguar bomb. By Alex Strider. He's looking to end this right now. It's Strider. Kicks him right in the gut. Going for the blade seeker. He's got him up. He's got him up there. Bam! Blade seeker by Alex Strider. Cover. One, two, and three. TV. Good evening to you all, ladies and gentlemen. My name is John Connolly, and I will be commentating the special Tiger Cave Exhibition Plus Showcase match as we have two young men in the wrestling business going up against each other as they will be looking to make a name for themselves in front of this Tiger Cave. Wrestling fans and wrestling fans all over the world as we can see the first man coming down to the ring I do not know much about this man, but I will refer to my notes to see what I have on him and Call the best for this man here okay. Well ladies and gentlemen, it seems that there is nothing much to report on this man All I have here is that he made his debut at an event called Brawlin' Hayes where he picked up the victory against Combat Wombat and that his name is El Venganza I hope I pronounced that right El Venganza El Venganza I, I'm not good with phonetics but ladies and gentlemen he is here to face off against a young tiger a trainee in the tiger cave that Jay Williams runs and that man is none other than a young tiger gold ladies and gentlemen and speaking of the devil, you can see him himself. Now let me refer to my notes to give you a rundown of Young Tiger Gold. Young Tiger Gold, but uh, Young Tiger here at the Tiger Cave. 19 years old, and he is an amateur wrestling champion. So you can already see that he is he is more than enough suitable to train for the Tiger Cave. With credentials like that, being an amateur wrestling champion is no easy feat. You can expect him to have an advantage over El Venganza here in the map wrestling game you can expect Young Tiger Gold to take El Venganza to the mat and probably get most of his offense out from the map and possibly pick up the victory in this exhibition match you can see Young Tiger Gold run for the spotlight you can see him embracing the crowd he is ready to show off his abilities to this Tiger Cave crowd and pick up the victory here against El Venganza as someone who doesn't have much to report on them, do you think that do you think it might be hard for some of these wrestlers to go in against people that are relatively unknown and try and have a game plan against that against them? I don't think that phases young Tiger Woods because he just embracing the crowd and he will be going up against El Bandanza here, ladies and gentlemen. You see the crowd in anticipation here of Venganza, Young Tiger Gold, both men looking to pick up a victory as the referee rings the bell here and this match is underway. 
Yeah, both men circling the ring here. This is exhibition match here, as you can see. Colin Elbow tie up from both men, and now Young Tiger Gold into the belly to back position and just takes down El Ganza. And as you can see, that amateur wrestling background coming into play here. Amateur wrestling champion is Young Tiger Gold. He has an advantage on the ground game and the mat game and just throws El Ganza off like he's nothing, as you can see. Young Tiger Gold is ready and. I think Elvin Ganza is also ready now. Both men once again circling the ring. You just feel that this is a feeling out process as both men once again lock up. Now uh, Young Tiger Gold seems to have the advantage in this exchange here with a headlock. It's wrenching on the neck and now into this key lock here. But no, oh, Elvin Ganza now wasting time into his own headlock. You can see finally getting the advantage now just a close fist shot. And now back into the headlock once again, just getting that cheap shot in to face Young Tiger Gold and now taking him down into this grounded headlock. Just wrenching on the Young Tiger Gold and with another close fist. Just trying to phase Young Tiger Gold with this cheap shots here without wrenching on the neck of Young Tiger Gold. And now Vangaza in control here. Side note here, do you see the biceps of Elvin Gaza, this man is, looks very strong, small in size to Young Tiger Gold, but he looks like a strong man. Now pushing Young Tiger Gold off the ropes here. Another leapfrog, another leapfrog, and oh, was going for a short attack, but Young Tiger Gold just shrugging it off, and now he wants Elvin Gaza to go off the ropes again. Off the ropes, Elvin Gaza goes, and another short attack, but to no avail. Struck off once again by Young Tiger Gold. Now, Elvin Gaza calling to go off the ropes, and he does another shoulder tackle. Off the ropes, he goes again, and another shoulder tackle, taking on El Gaza. And oh, El Gaza throwing him onto the apron. What's he going for here? And oh, oh my, oh my God, El Gaza with the shots to the chest and kick. Oh my God. And now hooks the leg here after that. Throw your strikes. Not, be, not sure he was able to get the job done, as you can see, Young Tiger Gold kicking out at two. First pin attempt of the match, ladies and gentlemen, and right back into the headlock is El Vanganza. No wasted motion here, trying to keep Young Tiger Gold down, not allowing him to get his bridge. You can see another cheap shot, just trying to keep him on face, and another cheap shot. Just messing up with his thinking here. You think Young Tiger Gold trying to escape the headlock, but has to deal with cheap shots. And now a snap mirror by El Vanganza, and a shot to the back. And a kick. No, no, no. Young Tiger Go catches. But no, spinning him around. And it'll go for German suplex. But Young Tiger Go with an elbow. And oh, it's a kick to the midsection. And now Young Tiger Go with a beautiful back suplex. And now Young Tiger Go to control. You see, sizing up Elvin Gaza for something here. And a beautiful cravat suplex. Taking Elvin Gaza down. Now hooks the leg here. One. Two, possibly picking up the victory, no. Elvin Gonza managing to kick out a two, and now Young Tiger Gold is in control here. Of the mysterious man donning a panther mask in Elvin Gonza. And that was just a shorter tackle to the corner, and another shorter tackle. You see, Young Tiger Gold is driving the shoulders into the midsection of Elvin Gonza. And now Young Tiger Gold off the corner he goes looking for something here, but no, El Vanganza manages to get the boot up. And a beautiful hip toss by El Vanganza off the ropes he goes and just drives the knee into the back. And Young Tiger Gold rolling to the outside to get his bearings here after that knee to the back from El Vanganza. Now El Vanganza looking to fly, but into the ring he goes, no, ducks the clothesline and a beautiful back suplex by El Vanganza. Now hooks the leg. One. Two, picking up the victory. No, Young Tiger Gold getting the shoulder up, and as you can see, Elvin Gaza does not believe. Arguing with the ref here about that two count, maybe he counted it a little bit slow. Now Elvin Gaza, now hoisting him up with the strike, and oh my God! Now rolls through into another gut wrench. Calling back to what I said about his biceps, you can see this man Elvin Gaza already showed off his strength with this beautiful gut wrench suplex, and now just. Goes into the pin with ease now, hooks the leg. No, will he get in a count of two from the Gutman suplex on Young Tiger Gould and now into this wrist lock. 
I, I, I do not know what to call this. Wrapping the wrists around his thighs and now dragging back on the chin of young Tiger Gold. Innovative submission here by Elvin Gaza. As you can see, young Tiger Gold managing to escape from the submission. Now, young Tiger Gold managing to be here with his lariat and another lariat just sending Elvin Gaza to the corner. And now, young Tiger Gold letting out a shout. He's feeling it all, just driving the shoulder to the midsection, and a beautiful overhead belly to belly. And Young Tiger Gold is on fire, ladies and gentlemen. And now, hoisting him up into the power stand. No, just beautiful. A beautiful shot of power bomb here. Two, there's got to be a no. Young, young Tiger Gold almost picking up the victory against Elvin Gaza, but Elvin Gaza managed to kick out a two. And now Young Tiger Gold sizing up for the end here. And now looking to make Elvin Gaza tap out here with this beautiful abdominal stretch here. Just stretching out the message to Shades of Namo here with this beautiful abdominal stretch. But all Elvin Gaza managed to escape flipping out of it. But wait, what's he going for here? Oh, and a beautiful cutter by Elvin Gaza. Beautiful maneuver there. And Elvin Gaza looking to end this, ladies and gentlemen. Ladies and gentlemen, there is something I left out of my notes here because I thought I would see it in the end of the match and I was right. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the Panther Tooth Elbow, the PTE by Elvin Gonza. And ladies and gentlemen, this looks like the end of the match for a one, a two, and three. As I said, the Panther Tooth Elbow picking up the victory for Elvin Gonza in this special Tiger King exhibition and showcase match.
That fiery temper almost got the best of Yuya, but now it might do it. Dragon Driver! Oh my god! I, the co-leader of BDA, Prince TJ, am now declaring war on the Tiger King. And that war will start. We can be entering the Tiger Challenge. And if I lose, I'll tell my tail through my legs again. But if I win, I will be honorary member of the king. If you say no, this will happen to you. Like I said, Williams, so don't deny me. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Tiger Cage. I am Ben and I will be the voice of this special occasion. And this occasion is so special because this is the Tiger Challenge. The Tyrant Challenge that was made by Prince TJ of the BDA. And conspicuous of his absence is Jay Williams, who is not here. And he is busy going hybrid for business. So the original order will be changed for the As you can see, Jay Williams is not in the lineup. And TJ's first challenge is about to start right now. Here comes the ref coming inside the ring, waiting for the two participants. And here we go. Calls himself the ace of the BDA, the current Caribbean champion, the current AWE World Heavyweight Champion, defeated Joshua Phoenix. Here it comes. Prince TJ, Prince TJ, coming out with the Jaguar match. Excuse me, not the Jaguar match, but the Tiger match. He's having his own Tiger match. Disrespecting Jay Williams, he is looking to win this Tiger Medal of Honor and be inducted into the cave. That is what you get. If you do, if you successfully win this Tiger Challenge, can TJ Ray do something that Vogue himself could not do? If that is win the Tiger Challenge and get that Tiger Medal of Honor. Chris TJ inside the ring. The disrespect is real. In this man. And of course, a lot of his titles are here. No titles are on the line. And here comes the young gold and mainly Matt Wrestler. And the youngest out of the young tigers. Yeah, oh, whoa, 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 wait a minute! It, it was like, that's Kiyoshi Saiba, he just chopped blocked! Gold right here! Prince TJ, you know Prince, Prince TJ had a plan. You knew that he had a plan. You know what you do this honorably? 
Kiyoshi Saiba, the BMW World Heritage Champion. Throw through gold inside the ring. And now, oh, look at this gold. Fighting back here. Oh, Larry at that gold. And another Larry. And another. TJ Ray swapped in the corner. Gold. Bill hyping himself for charging at a big shoulder charge. And then, oh, belly to belly, so close by gold. The attack by Saba did not deter him one bit. Got him in the fire miscarry position. Oh, he gets out of it. Oh, beautiful net breaker there. By Prince TJ. Prince TJ going up the top rope. And beast from a bar. This ain't take on it all. One, two, and three. Go for a fight. But with the assistance of that man, Kyoki Saiba, Prince TJ gets past the first challenge. Now let's see the second challenge. Oh, that was way too easy for TJ, even though Gold put up one hell of a fight. First round is over. Up next is the second round. And now he's waiting for his second opponent. Round two. And round two is Ito Sakura. Ito Sakura, Sakura the striker of the group. Had a match here before against uh, Mikey Dyer. Had that uh, fight against Jester, AOC Japan. I believe he was part of the Tiger Challenge before against Vogan. This was a very great first round. He was the first round for Vogan. Can Uto Sakura in the Pest TV fight early? We will see. 5'10", 193 pounds. But that doesn't mean much because he hits like a tank. Very proficient striker is Ito Sakura. That's what something he's looking to do. He's looking to strike. He's looking to slow down. Plus TJ. With his striking. That's something that he has to do. Ito Sakura inside the ring. Focus and determined as ever. Crowd again behind him here. TJ Wave is the is the enemy. Are we waiting for the bell? And there it is. Here's TJ Ito Sakura right. They're just sitting in the ring and they both talking trash to each other. Oh, what an elbow by Ito. Chris TJ with an elbow. Right back to Ito Sakura. An elbow by Ito. As he obliges Chris TJ. Both right in the middle of the ring. Exchanging balls here. Exchanging elbow. What an elbow by Chris TJ in a big time elbow. A slashing elbow. An elbow by Chris TJ. Another, oh, what a headbutt. For good measure. Look at these. Also, they elbow, back elbow, bust off the ropes. Oh, good time, back elbow by Ito. Going strike for strike. Ito's going to win that one. No doubt about it. And look at this. Look at this. What's Ito doing right here? Take it off the mask of Prince TJ. And even said the disrespect is over. You will not disrespect this cave. And Ito Sakura picking up TJ. 
He's got him. What's he going to do? Oh, put TJ puts it off here. Oh, overhand chop. Oh, look at him screaming to the high heavens. Tell him, is that all you got? Oh, big time. Overhand chop. And look at this. Chris TJ backing up. Oh, big time headlock. Right in the middle of the ring. Oh, oh this man can't chop. hit me. He said, give me more. Oh, on oh, another chop by Chris TJ. These guys are not letting up here. My goodness, and look at this, he's still sacking up. I was whip. Oh. Right to the apron, springboard, drop kick by Chris TJ. One, two, and no, only a two. Chris TJ has to use his speed, he has to use his time. Oh! Face cut right there. By Chris TJ. Oh, a kick right to the spine there. Vito Sakura in trouble. Chris TJ, TJ in control and look at this slowing it down. No, oh, not rushing at all. Can never kick right to the back. TJ once again picking a bomb ball. Uh oh. You said enough of that. And look at the Pierce TJ back it off. He's charging. Oh, big time. That's a good. That was a kid. Excuse me. Ito Sakura eats those. Oh, trying to go for a spin. Larry and a half there. And both men are down. Ito Sakura ate that Yakuza kick and hit him with a half dusty suplex. It looks like Ito would be the first man to get up here. And now press TJ, follow his suit. Both men using the ropes to get back, get back up. They're both beating the hell out of each other in this second round of the Tiger Challenge. He's charging. Oh! He's not done. And another drop kick. And again, he's going back to the other side of the corner. He's not done. Another drop kick. And oh! Back and forth he goes, will he stop? Nobody knows! And then, oh, hesitation drop kick by Ito Sakura. Ito Sakura looking to end Piss TJ's night early here in Japan, here in the Tiger Cave, in this Tiger Challenge. He is up on the top rope. What's he gonna do? Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute, that's Scarlet. Scarlet distracted Ito, and Piss TJ just punches him out. But look at Ito, Hazar. Bouncing on the ropes, what are gonna do? Oh! Bouncer oh, sets the power bomb! With ease! And Piss TJ knows it. Throws him right inside the ring. And now Piss TJ going up the top rope. Looking for, well, he's looking for something here. And now he's wasting time. It's Piss TJ. Meteora has got him! Head one, two, and now only a two. And now Chris TJ has to do something here. Ito Sakura slowly getting back up on his feet. And now Chris TJ is telling Ito Sakura, your night is done. This round is over. Oh, but wait a minute. Ito fights right out of it. Got him in a front face lock. A guillotine. He has a guillotine on. He has a guillotine locked. Right in the middle of the ring. Run tell the priest CJ does he give up? Is he the tap or go to sleep? The Ito Sakura is begging. Not really begging, but he's hoping that Piss TJ goes to sleep. Because you know Piss TJ is not gonna tap. But look at this. Piss TJ going up. Oh the strength of the slams him right down. Just to get out of that guillotine choke. Look at this, go behind. Dragon suplex. Oh, but wait a minute, Ito Sakura is back up on his feet. He's back up on his feet. German suplex. That was all about Chris TJ himself. He's back up on his feet. German suplex. They're trading German suplexes here. What in the world is it? Oh! 
by Chris TJ. One, two, and what the world? What is he doing? Just lift his head up. Pulling on that. Breaking the count. What is he looking for here? He's in the corner. Oh, trying to go for a big guy. This is a kick, but Ito Sakura moves out the way. Oh, what a big time. Out ball by Ito. And now Ito. Telling Chris TJ to get up. Scarlet again with the distraction. And now, at first it was Kiyoshi. And now it's, and now it's Scarlet. Oh, no, no blow. No blow. Kicks him right in the gut. Oh, Dark Dragon driver right there. And the ref now, he focuses on this pin here, too. And three. That is it. He beats Ito Sakura again with the assist of a member of the BDA, Scarlet. I mean, Chris TJ came here with the plan. He didn't come here with honor in mind. I mean, he, this man came out here with the with the tiger mask, respecting the tiger, disrespecting the tiger, the tiger king. He thinks he's gonna come up. Round three. Round three, that's Big Fergie. And I was saying, you thinking that he was gonna, you think that he was gonna come to Tiger Cave with nothing but respect, you're lying to yourself. And here comes Big Fergie. Was trained by War Tiger to be a monster. War Tiger, who was the last, the last man in this Tiger Challenge, but he has to get past Big Fergie. First, I mean, you know what? TJ, Chris TJ, outsmarted and cheated his way throughout this challenge and is disrespecting the, the Tiger Cave. He's disrespecting the cave. As I said before, he came out here with a Tiger mask on. And he come here out of respect. He called him out. And there's a bell. He called him out. And then, oh, wait a minute. Fergie, oh, look at this. Chris TJ. This, this power's out. Scarlet is still there. Scarlet is still at ringside. They call Big Fergie. Oh, now Chris TJ rolls right back in, slides right back inside the ring. And Big, and Big Fergie is very angry. Very young, too. Very young, too. He has to keep his anger in His anger. Oh! And again, rolls right out. Right out. And look at Big Fergie going, taking chase. Give him chase. The piss TJ. And he's running. Oh my god! <laughs> she, he just ran through. Scarlet with that land and continues to chase Chris TJ. And a drop kick, but he does not go down. Big Fergie is a big ball. Oh my god. Oh, kick right to the gut. A big Fergie. As I was saying, Big Fergie is he's big, but he is young. He cannot let his emotions get the best of him because Chris TJ won't do that. But now he is in control of this match. One, two, not only a two. And I'm pretty sure one time has taught him that. Keep his emotions in check. And what's this? You see the big, the feet, and the tree trunk legs. Big Fergie. Rolling right in the middle of the ring. He's boozling him right now. He's got him and throws him. Oh, he throws him. Almost to the corner. The strength of Big Fergie. And TJ is just sitting there probably, probably saying maybe this was not a good idea. And now this is this is a rookie mistake here. This is a, this is a rookie mistake. Oh, look at this. Got him up in a power opposition. And as I said before, rookie mistake. He just, just 
capitalized it while he was on his knees, and now look at the lightning draft by Chris TJ. And boom! And did not go down. Bounce it off the ropes. Oh! Now they crisscrossing here. The big man's gone! Pasta going off his kick pad! My goodness, and now Chris CJ is a smart thing to do. Just roll outside the ring, catch his burns, if Big Fergie will allow him to. Rough counting here. Big Fergie going outside, not letting Chris TJ catch his breath. Those are right inside the ring. The third round of the Tiger Challenge. Big Fergie, right in the corner. What's he gonna do? Charging. Oh, look at this smart move. Grab the legs, take the legs. Take that vertical base away from him. Got him right in the ankle lock. That's Chris TJ. Chris TJ has that ankle locked. Applied here. And look at this. Oh, trying to roll. And look, he's still holding on. Pit Bulldog gets a lock right on that leg. He is not letting go here. And now he great fires the leg. He great fires the leg. There's no way for Big Fergie to go. Oh, there's that rope. All you got to do is reach. All he has to do is reach. He's big enough to reach. He's tall enough to reach. And look at this! Kicking his way out! It's Big Fergie! But that leg is damaged. Oh, but look at this, Big Fergie! Oh, DDT! Not too far so! Now he's going for the cover! One, two, and oh, the Yaku! So close! Oh, winning the third round here at the Tiger Challenge! And TJ Ray, oh, he's pushed him. What was that for? What was that for? He just pushed the ref, and now the ref is outside. And Prince TJ, what is he doing? What is he doing? Oh, he has a chair. Come on. Come on. Come on. Hitting the chair. And now he's hitting the, he, he's hitting the leg with that chair. Damaging the leg. Oh no, he has that. You, you don't think he's looking to feminize. Oh my god! Stomped on that leg after wrapping that chair around the leg. He just feminized. Big Fergie. And now the ref is back inside. And back into the ankle line. Now this is a foregone conclusion here. He's been damaging that leg. Going to work on that leg of Big Fergie. He did that. All right. Oh, there it is. There it is. There it is. There it is. Third round is over. I must admit. I must admit. That was, that was, that was pretty smart. I mean, he pushed the ref. He pushed the ref. Got a chair to start wailing on the leg of Big Fergie. Oh, that's that. I, 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 I must have been. That was a smart move. TJ Ray. He's won the third round here. And he is in the same position as Vogan was in the first Tiger Challenge. Now, his fourth round is going to be his biggest test as he'll be going up, going up against War Tiger. What is this here? 
宿命を外れしよう血迷ったかと察したてまつわるらの無力さ死ぬがいよ死して屍拾うものなしかうわら剣を極めし者なり Oh, but look at this! Wall Tiger just gave up his spot to Kid Tiger! So it won't be Wall Tiger that will be the final round, it will be Kid Tiger! The Hype Tiger himself! He wants to prove himself to Jay Williams! He is not having one of the best win loss records here in his career. Losing to Darren Dashman. Losing to Tyrain, losing to Isaiah Snoovitz. And Jay Williams' patience has run thin with Kid Tiger. I'm I, I, probably bold to say that he's been out of patience, but Kid Tiger will not give up. He has not given it up. He wants to prove himself to Jay, to Jay Williams. But this this is a chance because TJ Rave is out of breath. TJ Rave has been through three rounds during the Tiger Cage. War Tiger is fresh. Excuse me, not War Tiger. Kid Tiger is fresh. The Hype Tiger is fresh. Prince TJ is not. And here we go. The final round has begun. The final round of the of this Tiger Challenge pits TJ versus the Hype Tiger. Kid Tiger. He had the place. Oh, look at this. He can't even try to punch him, but he's just running here. Try to hit him with a super kick again. Kid Tiger dodges, trying to go for a punch. Dodges again. He is out of breath. He is out of breath. Oh, he's telling him to cross the line here. Oh! Kid Tiger Ducks, Colin will tie up. I don't think about Kid Tiger, I'll tell you what, man. Chris TJ, no matter the, the shortcuts or whatever, the help from Kiyoshi Cyber, the help from Scarlet. Oh! He still had to go through three men. Oh, look at this beautiful move right there. Look at the, look at the, the movements. Oh, right to a cup, right to a chicken wing. Oh, stumps on the, the feet and the elbow. Oh, call it over time once again. Kid Tiger pushing Chris TJ up to the ropes. Ref coming in telling him to break the hole. And look at this, he's dancing now. Call it over time once again. Side headlock. That's boom! Chris TJ. It is wrenching on the head of Kid Tiger. Kid Tiger now pushes back and pushes off, bouncing off the ropes. Drop down by Kid Tiger. Leaf frogs. Another leaf frog. And now look at this. He said, I can do this all day. It's frustrating. There's TJ here. Charging, misses the clothesline. Oh, trying to go for another elbow. But no, oh, going for another corner. Oh, look at this. I can't even keep up. Oh, Frankenstein is stopped. Oh, he's got a bit of No! He's not this time. He is on fire here as Kid Tiger and Prince TJ Smart Move rolling outside the ring here. Oh, but wait a minute, wait a minute, Kid Tiger! Oh! Topan from the hero! By Kid Tiger! Kid Tiger now picking up Prince TJ. What's he gonna do with the pop? He's gonna put him. Right back inside the ring. Yes, he does. Both men are inside the ring now. His TJ slowly getting back up on his feet. Kid Tiger is hyped up, kicks him right in the gut. He's got his arm. What's he gonna do? Going up to the top and a beautiful all drag from the top rope. And Chris TJ back up on his feet on the hand, on the hook. All drag right there. Bossing on the ropes once again. And oh! This them good then. Go for the cover. One, two, no, only a two. Only a two. 
Oh, look at this. He's digging in the mask now. And now press TJ. But the disrespect is real with this man. So much talent. He has to resort to these underhanded tactics. He has to get the assist from Kiyoshi side. He had to get the oh! assist from Scarlett. Cover one, two, and now the 18. And Chris TJ is frustrated. Stomp right to the face of Kid Tyler. And I stomp it on him again, but he's holding on to the wrist of Kid Tiger just stomping the little hell out of his face. As you can see, Scarlet is not here. Scarlet is not here. Chris TJ is going up the top rope. Chris TJ! Oh! Piece of the bomb! No water in the pool as Kid Tiger puts the knees up. Oh, nice go by there. Oh, look at the... Oh! It's a good, but gets a block. Keeps him right in the blocks. Oh, beautiful move right there. Go for the cover. Go for the cover. Will! Chris TJ! No, you will not. And Kid Tiger is back up on his feet. Kid Tiger is back up on his feet. Elbow by Chris TJ. And he's eight, eight that. He's saying, give me more. He's another, another elbow. Kid Tiger wants some more. Oh, another elbow. And again. Short is fighting spirit. Misses the punch. Fresh crusher. Cross him on the ropes. Big boot. And a kick. Another kick. Misses the lariat. Oh, a kick from the ground. Kid Tiger is on fire. Oh, he's on the apron back elbow. What's he gonna do here? Tiger fake kick! From the ring post! And he's going on the top rope! And diamond headbutt! Why can't Tiger get Tiger? One, two, is it over? No, it's not! Chris TJ, he gets the shoulder up. The Tiger Challenge continues here, but Kid Tiger in control. Momentum is on the side of Kid Tiger. Look at this try to go for a Tiger suplex. Chris TJ. Oh, he pulled the right in the eye. River kick. By Chris TJ. One, two, and no. So close. So close. He's that close. I'm winning the Tiger Challenge here. But it continues. What a match we're seeing here. And now Piss TJ putting Kid Tiger on the top rope. Now what do you know? He's, he's got him in a superplex position. No, no. Oh my God, no. This is the same move that Scooby Jews. That gave Kid Tiger the concussion, but thank God he got out of it. Oh my God! Chris TJ was starting, he was powering outside when Kid Tiger saw the hit him with the Asai Musa. The cut him off in the pass, that was beautiful. No more escaping, said Kid Tiger. He's got that arm up, look like he's going, he's going for a lariat. This Kid Tiger. Oh, rolling elbow this time. Oh my goodness. Rolling elbow by Kid Tiger. Cover one, two, no, only two. And Kid Tiger is arguing with the breath. He has to stay focused here. The final round of the, of the Tiger Challenge. This is important. If he can beat, T if he can beat Prince TJ, he can be in the good graces of Jay Williams. That's exactly what he wants. Rolling elbow wants to get no. Transitions right into a dragon sleeper. He's got the dragon sleeper in supply here. Will Kid Tiger hold on or will he tap out? This dragon sleeper is sick good. And now he's got a now he's got a great fight here. He's got a great fight here. K 
kid trying to fight to get out of this submission hold. He was fighting to get, his, get out of this submission hold here. Can he do it? And he does. Oh, look at this. He's got the pin. He's got the pin. One, two, and oh, he got him. He got him. Kid Tiger. Kid Tiger. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Here comes War Tiger. War Tiger. Eyeball and piss TJ. Oh, look at this. Talking trash in the big man. Look at this. Oh, look at this. 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 Officially. Look at this. He didn't even win. But he seems to invite him anyway. Ladies and gentlemen. This has been Antoine Britton from the Tiger Cave. Thank you for joining us.